Smart Timer Encounter is a powerful jQuery uh, plugin um, that uses CSS for all the styling and uh, it requires no images to work. Uh, here you see a basic example and uh, some instructions on how to uh, use this, uh, this plugin. On this page, you can find uh, more information about the way to, to use the skin, uh, to use the plugin, and uh, what which files you need to load. Uh, here are the demos. First is a clock demos, and the uh, plugin works uh, uh, using two different modes. One is a clock, and the other is counter. Also. Plugin comes with four different skins, and skins are used to uh, customize the look of the plugin. This is a simple skin, it uses no animation, it simply switches numbers. It has 14 different uh, uh, styles built in. So you can try them all in this demo, and you can see how they look on different uh, backgrounds. Uh, it uses only CSS, so uh, you can get transparent uh, styles and many other things that uh, look really nice uh, and require no images. Uh, next is the animated skin, and also in this case we are seeing another uh, language using, uh, in this case Serbian. Uh, plugin allows uh, creation of language packs, and you can uh, load different languages for each of your clocks and counters. Uh, adding uh, new files is easy, and in future versions more languages will be added. Uh, this is. Uh, this one uh, shows uh, the whole date, uh, days, months, years, uh, and everything else. And this also shows you that you can customize which element will be visible inside each clock. Here we have slide down effect uh, used. This animated skin has a bit different uh, style, so you can check them out also. Here we have a shorter version with custom layout using days, hours, minutes, and seconds. And in this case, we are using fade animation. Next is a circular clock, uh, and uh, this uses canvas to render, and it's based on the knob jQuery plugin that's included without modifications, so you can customize it uh, uh, to choose size and everything else for each of the dials, and we'll see that later. And also, uh, for clock mode, you can uh, custom set future or past date to start counting from, in this case 2015. And very interesting skin is the inline skin, allowing you to use uh, a span element and apply uh, clock to that element, allowing you to put a clock anywhere in the text. It comes with few skins only, and it's uh, really effective uh, to use uh, inside the text and still have a working clock or counter. As for counters, uh, same skins, but in this case uh, we have uh, a countdown mode, counting down from uh, this number of seconds, and that's 11 days and so on.
Uh, in this case, we are counting down uh, to date 4th of October 2015, and we have 727 days left until then. Uh, next we have count up, so uh, clock starts from zero and counting to set number of seconds. This is uh, also a fade, uh, in this case fade out animation. And uh, when it comes to circular clock, you can see that each dial can be customized. And you can use even transparent uh, colors. And here is the version of uh, inline skin and uh, counter to set date. Uh, plugin is uh, uh, easy to use and uh, it has a large number of settings you can uh, uh, change and it is easy to integrate into any project. Uh, also, the output is fully responsive, so if you uh, make screen smaller, it will first uh, uh, make a counter smaller and then it will be easy to display. If the space is not enough, it will split uh, uh, into two lines or more depending on the screen size and the number of elements.